Hi, we the Frosties are going to randomly choose people from Facebook and mention their name at the end of the videos. Tanya um, asked me to, she wants to hang the Aussie flag up, so we're going to attach it to the top of this uh, door track. I've uh, made a tubular frame up to uh, to fit on that, so the curtain or the blind or the Aussie flag can be hung from there. Um, this is the thing I made up for above that door. Um, I've uh, used a bit of uh, fence tubing, one of those spear type, or uh, yeah, I suppose it's, so it's a spear type of tubular fencing uh, cut out of a fence and it's adapted this bracket sort of system so that we can um, utilize it on our on this curtain or the blind for the Aussie flag and it's made up a hook or a hook up hook the ring on and obviously the flat is going to be screwed to the top of it and just made it up well together as such and uh, yeah same with the other end obviously so we screw it and attach it so that it doesn't fall down. This is um, <coughs> this is the uh, curtain frame that I rod that I made up, and uh, it's the one I fixed on there. It's really flat. Um, got a couple of screws in, pre-drilled those screw holes and screwed into this steel framing. And you can't see it. It's the same on that top. That little funny sh shaped dip that I had in it before, and. That was the hook. That was the hook that I made up. I'll weld onto it to so hook this in onto it. And then we can just pull this back tight and tall. We just got to change this and put a little hook on this end. Put it over, make it a bit shorter so it wraps around a bit. So it's quite simple now to while we're travelling. Then you can, or I can just pull this back and gather it up like a normal curtain. And um, you can then just hook this other hook up there, holds the curtain right back. And then Tanya's also done a tie down the bottom, so we can tie that back out the road. So when we're travelling, I don't have to look up here around the curtain, you can see straight through the window and look through the mirrors, and there's no obstruction. So, and Tanya sewed that actually with a little sewing machine, the new one she bought. I was mucking around on. Did quite a good job on uh, fairly heavy material too. So it's amazing for a little machine. So that's that's our little addition to our home. Hi to GB and Cal Jones.